Hello, T. Will. What are you doing? Uh, I think I'm going to make you tell your story. Okay, T. Will. So this story is called The Dot by Peter H. Reynolds. Our class was over, but Vashti sat glued to her chair. Her paper was empty. Vashti's teacher leaned over the blank paper. Ah, a polar bear in a snowstorm, she said. Very funny, she said Vashti. I just can't draw. The teacher smiled. Just make a mark. See? And see where it takes you. Vashti grabbed a marker and gave the paper a big, a good strong jab. There! Her teacher picked up the paper and studied it carefully. Hmm. She pushed the paper towards Vashti's and Fashi and quietly said, Now, signed it. Fashi thought for a moment, Well, I can't draw, but I can't sign my name. The next week, when Fashi walked into our class, she was surprised to see what was hanging above her teacher's desk. <gasps> It was the little dot she had drawn. Her dot, all framed in swirly gold. Hmm. I'll, mm, I can make a better dot than that. She opened her never-before-used set of watercolors and set to work. Vashi painted and painted a red dot, a purple dot, a yellow dot and a blue dot. The blue mixed with the yellow. She discovered that she could make a green dot. Vashti kept experimenting lots of dots and many colors. If I make... If I can make little dots, I can make bigger dots too. Vashti splashed her colors with a bigger brush on a bigger paper to make bigger dots. Vashti even made a dot by not painting a dot. At the school art show, a few weeks later, Vashti, Vashti's mini Dots made quite a splash. Vashti noticed a little boy gazing at her, about, about her. You're a very great artist. I wish I could draw, he said. I bet you can, said Vashti. Me? No, not me. I can draw a straight line with a ruler. Vashi smiled. He handed the boy a blank sheet of paper. Show me. The boy's pencil shook as he drew his line. Vashi stared at the boy's squiggle. And then she said, Sign it. And, and that is the story of the dot. What do you think, Chiwu? I think I love this story. Fills in my heart. And I kind of been a little bit hungry. Okay, hope you enjoy your book. See you next time.